Uh, Socks for Souls, a uh, Cypress College Veterans Organization, had the honor of meeting California's oldest female, B.M. Cohen. She's 102 years old, who served as Private First Class in the Army during World War II. She told us about her husband, who also served in World War II and Korea, and how she lost a son in uh, Vietnam. Uh, she told us about how much she, she loved her country and, you know, its veterans. But she began to cry during her speech because she'd started to discuss homeless veterans and how, you know, they were everywhere in the city that she's living in. And uh, she told us how she spends her time. So she basically kind of inspired us to gather socks. And she said, hey, you know, when you go to buy a package of socks, you know, pick up an extra one because, you know, you can give that to a homeless guy. So, you know, after li listening to this lady who, you know, she's a Jewish lady that served in World War II, that went across the ocean uh, and served in England and was telling stories about how the boat was zigging and zagging to, you know, fear off the U-boats. And, uh, how, I mean, it was real. It was 100%. She gave herself. And uh, she's always been 100% supporting. She lost, you know, like I said, you know, her husband was a POW in Korea and lost a son in Vietnam. But she just, it broke her heart to see a bunch of veterans homeless laying on the streets. So seeing that that's all she, she wanted us to do was gather socks, um, I thought it was really cool. And we met her on Veterans Day 11-11-11. And uh, what we wanted to do with that was, uh, where was it? You know, we were all moved by it. Some of us were brought to tears because, I mean, just, dude, this is an American right here. And uh, so we decided that we wanted to bless her and thank her for her service by gathering socks uh, to give to her so that she could spend her days handing them out. So basically that was the idea behind everything as we wanted to really thank this veteran. You know, if not, she's actually definitely California's oldest female veteran, but she might be actually America's oldest female veteran. What is your, your your total goal of how many socks uh, you guys would like to purchase? I would love to take a truckload down there. I don't care how big. I mean, I would love to take a thousand socks down there if I could. I wish I could. I mean, as much as I can. If a company could, you know, give me cases, I would do it. You know what I mean? I, whatever I can get my hands on to give her. Because it, it, it's just a thought that's going to bless her. And, I mean, this is, this lady, I mean, it's going it, to, it's blessing her and blessing veterans all at the same time. And I've worked but uh, veteran stand downs where the homeless veterans are there, and I've seen them first off, and it sucks not having socks, not having the things that they need. Socks is a big easy thing that they can, you know, yes. that's comfort. Yeah, I I am. Um, I spent like almost ten years volunteering at the VA hospital in Long Beach, so I've I've, I've seen a lot of right stuff that 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 goes on. Right, and well, we met her through the West LA home, okay. which was really cool. Um, and it's a newer veterans home. California has one up there. Um, it's by UCLA, I believe. But it's just, dude. I mean, it's what we can do. We're a veteran organization, so we want to help raise funds. You know, we also do stuff for our, our community, mm -hmm. but it's, you know, there's a need out there. There's more homeless veterans every day, and there's more going to be coming because they're getting out of the service. So this is just something to, you know, help repay, bless her, and help veterans all at the same time. Mm -hmm. And we just, you know, we, we always get a lot of support from people here at this campus, and we wanted to, you know. How much can someone donate? Uh, you can donate anywhere from a dollar to a million, whatever you want. I mean, no one's going to, we're not going to say no. Whatever your heart's, you know, a dollar would be more than fine. Mm -hmm. But uh, the more the merrier. And um, we just want to, we just, you know, we want to make, get it as much as possible. We're going to go and get it at cost. Um, we got a person that does wholesale. And that's where we're going to go with it after that. We're going to find the best possible deal with our, the money we raise. Um, I've gotten $20 bills. I think somebody wanted to donate 100 you know, different things like that. So, But really, a dollar would, you know, mm -hmm. a dollar would go a long way. 